Canada's spectacular Rocky Mountains are the setting for a gruelling 600km mountain bike race which will take an international field of riders up to 12,000 metres in altitude. The 131 competitors set off from the settlement of Fernie to face rough gravel roads, steep hills and mountain passes, some of them so steep the bikes had to be carried. This event has attracted both amateur and professional riders from Europe and North America and is billed as one of the toughest mountain bike races in the world. On the first stage, the leaders timed 4 hours, 9 minutes and 37 seconds, averaging more than 23 kilometres per hour over a course that gained 1,746 metres over the 94 kilometre track from Fernie, British Columbia to Blairmore, Alberta. The second stage from Dutch Creek saw the teams maintain their fast pace through 84 kilometers in bright sunshine. On day three, the riders were seriously tested by three summits from Dutch Creek to Etherington Creek, dropping the average speed of the leaders to less than 20 kilometers per hour for the first time. Despite suffering from cold, the lead was maintained with a finish time of 4.57.50. Some crashed out. Some had to stop to change flat tyres. But most managed to finish. After seven days, 600 kilometers and 12,000 meters of climbing, the end was in sight. Canmore, Alberta, after starting a week earlier in Fernie, British Columbia, 131 riders from Europe and North America have competed in this race, crossed the Rocky Mountains via steep hills and mountain passes. Christofferson and Makiva from Canmore finished in first place overall with a cumulative time of 31, 37, 52, 2 hours and took first place.